Hello everyone, what's up? It is me, Micah, and welcome to another Wife Life vlog. I honestly wanted to start my day with my quiet time, but I ended up answering some demanding emails, and then that's when I started doing my quiet time. Today's word was definitely soul food. It came from Joshua 22, and the key verse that I got from it is from verse 5, which says, Be careful to observe the commandment and the law that Moses, the servant of the Lord, commanded you to love the Lord your God and to walk in all his ways and to keep his commandments and to cling to him and to serve him with all your heart and all your soul. This is such a great reminder that observing the law of the Lord is actually a matter of the heart. Aside from that, it is not meant to restrain us because God's will is always higher and it is pleasing and perfect. Oh, diba? Ayos na ayos. Kala mo saan pupunta. Dito lang po tayo sa bahay maglilinis. <laughs> Speaking of, let me fill you in sa kung ano mong mga kailangan natin gawin for today. Medyo marami-rami akong mga agenda that I've set for myself because later on tonight, merong dinner na kailangan puntahan si Adrian and I will be going with him. So, there are some things that I need to prioritize even though I'm dreading to prioritize it. And you guys will see why. Remember, two Wife Life videos ago, I told you guys na meron tayong project na gagamitan nitong mga extra boxes. Now is the time na simulan at sana matapos yung project na yon. But I'm dreading it kasi sa dirty kitchen yon. I will show you guys the dirty kitchen in a while. The reason kung bakit ayoko talaga siyang gawin is because natatakot ako na may mga nagtatagong ipis or malaking spiders. Hindi talaga ako sobrang takot sa mga spiders. Pero pag malalaki na kasi sila, okay, nakakatakot na. Yung ipis talaga, lumilipad kasi, okay? Kaya takot ako sa kanila. Meron talaga tayong ganong fears. Yung iba, dagla. Yung iba, you know, other things. Pero to me, ipis is the key to my fears. Honestly guys, I cannot be happier that I'm partnering with Essa on this part of the video because they really pushed me to organize. Like, nakikita ko yung mga videos nila and yung mga posts nila on how people use their storage boxes and the like to organize their homes. And I was just really inspired by that. Essa actually doesn't only make mga home storage solution products, but they also have mga kitchen canisters, some items that will definitely be useful in your bathroom and again in your kitchen or your dining area. I would recommend that you check out their website para din alam nyo kung ano yung mga offers nila and see what best fits your day-to-day -day lifestyle. By the way, for those of you who are going to buy, I have a special code for all of you para meron kayong savings when you guys buy on their website. I know that I have been dreading this moment but I believe that it is about high time we get started with it. So let's do this. Truth, let me show you what our dirty kitchen looks like. It is dirty. Tan 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 tan. Ang dumi dumi. I mean, guys, ang dumi talaga. Ay ayo ko na mag zoom in kasi nakikita niyo naman. Sobrang kalat talaga nito. Um, I think this area, I'm not like super concerned. I think I just really have to clean it. But this part of the room is just. Ew. And because of that, let's get cleaning. It's time. <laughs> First thing I did was get rid of all the unnecessary boxes and I replaced them with these ESSA containers that you're actually meant to use inside of the refrigerator, but I decided to use them here. See, this is the reason why I took a lot of time. So I was very careful. proceeded to putting all the little abubots na nasa paper bag into these containers and inside of the bigger essa boxes and voila we've got it all together guys after three hours of hard work ta -da! oh my goodness it's so clean na alam niyo ba itsura niyan kanina lahat ng mga abubot and then yung mga tools just little things are inside of these boxes and even inside of some essa containers that are meant for the refrigerator pero i ended up just using them for inside of the other containers i really would not have been able to organize all of these little things without these essa boxes so i'm so grateful meron pa nga akong extra no 70 liters so i'm thinking gagamitin ko yung 
over yung mga extra na damit ni Adrian na hindi niya na ginagamit. Tapos lalagay ko ulit siya dun sa storage namin sa third floor. Wala na yung mga random paper bags. Ang dami kong tinapon. I mean, look at this pile of trashes. Ang dami pang laman nito. I will leave all the details of Essa in the description box below so you guys can check them out. Alright, and now, meron akong mga PR packages in a package that came today. I'm gonna show you guys that. First of all, ang gagawin natin bago yung PR packages is magta-try tayo ng mga swimsuit because I got some from Zalora. Guys, this is swimsuit number one. Honestly, ayoko, hindi ko alam kung super type ko yung ganitong style ng swimsuit. Parang lumalabas na ang laki-laki ng thighs ko. And then, parang nakakawala rin siya ng shape. May pagka-disappointed din ako dun sa top. Kasi parang nakalabas yung underwire niya. I don't know, what do you guys think about this? Parang cute siya na hindi. I might return it. By the way, I'm wearing underwear. I would never try on swimsuits and return them without underwear. This I love and this I am keeping. Ang ganda niya and I think that it's just, you know, such a wholesome swimsuit. I'm really into swimsuits like this because I'm such a conscious person. I'm not really the type to, you know, show off too much skin. So this is really right up my alley and also it accentuates the waist so well. This is pretty. I love it. Ang ganda nito. I've been so excited to open this. So this just came. This is from Penny Pears as usual. I always look forward to their gifts. And they always have a sweet letter for me. Really appreciate that. All right, let's open it up. Unayin muna natin yung nasa jewelry pouch. Ooh, I think there are two things in here. Oh my gosh, it's a layered necklace. Ah, I need this. Kasi natagal ko na naghahanap ng magandang layered necklace na magkadugtong na talaga. It's so nice. The other one is this beautiful ring. What the heck? Look at how pretty that is. My gulay. Yes, I will marry you. Next is the planner that Penny Pears gave me along with the jewelry. Let's see. Alam mo, sobrang love na love ko yung Penny Pears planner ko. Oh, speaking of, ito yung gamit ko kanina. Ayan, this whole year, ito lang yung gamit ko na planner. And sobrang useful niya. I love, love, love the layout. Siguro yung naging issue ko lang with this one, yung 2022 planner nila, is because of the material, ang bilis kong nadumihan yung notebook. Pero I like it as well in a way na parang alam mo used siya. And alam mo pagbukas mo, ang dami ko talaga niyang contents, if that makes sense. I really, really enjoyed the last planner that they had for this year, 2022. Excited to see this one for 2020. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, ang ganda naman. At saka, grabe, ibang iba yung texture niya. I'm not sure if you guys can see that, pero parang siyang may ridges. And it's leather now, so hindi na siya madaling madumihan. And ang bilis niyang linisin. Look at the front with that little twinkle. Say hi, come on. Hey! And then here, going back on the leather part of the planner, actually, half of the planner dotted Lang siya. It's just dotted pages where you can write your thoughts. This is where I write my daily Devo. So I'm really grateful for this space and I'm so so in love with the way that they organize their planners. I can't wait to use this. I can't wait to start the year. Babe, remember my my 2022 planner from Penny Pears? It's the one I use every day, right? Yeah. But yeah, so they gave me an, a new one for 2023 and it's even better than the first. The Penny Pears did. Yeah. Oh, cool. Do not mind the mess. It's all berry stuff. Here is my outfit for today. Let's ang bag. Shoes from Pajon, shorts from Zara, top from Zara. I love this little padded shoulder moment. Also, makeup check. Please, please, mo. Come on. Lakad mo to na una ako. All right, you guys, we're already late, so I'm going to end this vlog here. I'm leaving you with love, hope, and faith for today. Watch me, Michael Lewis, and a little bit of that guy. <laughs> Can't wait to see you again. Bye, everyone. Bye.